Derp, derp, derp. Yeah, caught so. I feel bad for Aaron though, honestly. Just, that's all. So yeah, there's a few people have talks here, and they try to get every character in. I believe they do get every character in. Even if, well, I guess they're not that related here. Fucking Ryan. God damn it, Luke. <laughs> ever and ever. Okay. Sirius is done, man. I don't think he did. We see him. I don't know. Oh yeah, this is this is the f the best part. Rogers all alone again. Too bad. Dashingness. Da -na -na. Fucking Descard. <laughs> Doesn't like the noise. Hey, shoot again. Too bad the Axe Fighters never got any use from me as well, though Barst is very good. Uh, I think if you don't recruit the characters in the scene, that the scene won't play at all, like if you miss one character from it. So yeah, you can pretty easily miss them. I'm tired of hitting the fucking fa go forward button, honestly. <laughs> Too much talking. <laughs> I'm glad this game has a lot more text. Wait for me! <laughs> oh, god damn it. Gets twice. Ah, uh, yeah, Beck and Jake, the fucking ballisticians. V. Nope. She don't need no man. And the wolf guard. Fucking that hat. Yeah, they already have a support. Come on. Fucking Bantu. Hey, there we go. And lastly, my unit gets something, and we get to see Marth kind of looking at us there. Um, I don't know what's his problem. No need for a name. Damn. Man, I'm glad this text is like completely fucking 100% finished and shit. Because I've been. 
So it's been on trans fucking iffy six thing, I realize how eh the translation is there. Compared to this, this is like fucking amazingly like finished completely. Hey, and we even got scrolling text. I have never read this. Now, the War of Heroes, this was called. Seven Kingdoms, huh? United Kingdom of Arcania! Wow. <laughs> Fucking UK. <laughs> I forget what the first war was called. I thought the. Wasn't this called the War of Shadows before in FC3? I can't remember. <laughs> United Kingdom. God damn it. Also, this is, this game actually has a nice uh, ending to it. Uh, right, so I think it's that screen. It's probably going to show you me my turn counts and shit as well. So this chapter is actually quite long, not because of the actual chapter, but because of the epilogue. Uh, right, so it's turn counts first, apparently. Yeah, it tells you the time, but um, I had uh, I had the game on for some time sometimes, which is why. It may have been longer than it actually was, or stuff like that. Uh, don't expect LTC fucking pro game strats here. I don't know what I'm on about. I don't think I really took my time with. I don't know. Chapter 3 was like 30. Yeah, 33, ch 33 turns. Yeah, I don't know. I don't think I grinded at all, so I sh my turn count shouldn't be that high. There's some chapters I took forever on. Like chapter 3. <laughs> One turning 6x, yeah. 8 turns on chapter 8? That's pretty fast, to be honest. Then again, you are getting chased relatively quickly. Yeah, fucking 10x. Hate that shit. Oh yeah, chapter 13 is probably pretty long too. 22 only? No. Thought it'd be more than that, honestly. But yes, some of these are David T. I mean, even though chapter 13 was only like 22 turns, it was still like an hour and 17 minutes, it said there. Uh, yeah, two turn chapter 16x. Not that bad. Battle of the Pass is pretty short. The final battle! Yeah, sure. 11 turns, yep. Uh, okay, end game 5 turns, not bad. Took me 53 minutes apparently. I think it was just because I was setting everything up for so long and that counts towards it, I think. Uh, okay. I'll take that. <laughs> I'm not gonna unlock anything because I've just been playing on normal with a save, you know, that has already unlocked everything, so it probably won't even give me anything. Hey, time to look at characters. This is uh, Luke. Uh, he's pretty good. He's pretty consistent, but I eventually dropped him. Roddy uh, doesn't start out as good, but he's a fairly good cavalier. Your starting three are pretty much your best. So yeah, Roddy's very good as well. So Seal, uh, I used her for a good majority of the game, but uh, eventually she didn't really get strength. Her strength and defense is her weak points. Gordon's okay in this game. He's probably better than he was in Shadow Dragon, so yeah. And on the other side we have Ryan, who has insane growth spot, pretty bad bases. I could have used them. Uh, I don't. I think he gave him a couple levels. He didn't turn out that good. Gentle giant. Doga here is fucking good. Actually, he's really good. If I used him. Aaron died. That's literally his ending. He's your Jagan, plain and simple. Malasia, she's very good. She's very good as a healer. She's very good as a sage. Become a delinquent, really. Oh. Middle sister, is that all you get? Catria is probably the best character in the game behind my unit. Warren was actually pretty good for me and uh, I enjoyed using him. Uh, he's not that bad at all. 
record the chopper. Wow. Wow. The chopper. Uh, Cord's pretty good, I think. He's not as good as Bars, but whatever. Linda, she's a good mage. Yeah, these are translations a bit. I ba basically the endings are the same as FE3, I think. Pala is a very good Pegasus Knight, but not as good as Catria, but still very good. The Lopper, <laughs> the Lopper. <laughs> Bard is, uh, I think he's the worst of the three fighters. Well, the three um, fighters you get at the start. Noble Thief. Joe your best thief. That's him. He's also a pretty good combat unit. I probably could have used him more than I did. Mathis is just Mathis, man. <laughs> In all honesty, he's average. He's not even bad, honestly. Like People say he's bad, but he's not actually that bad. Reese is bad. <laughs> Reese is a bad healer. He could probably get magic a bit, but you know. Ogma is very good. Bordering on amazing. Yumira is okay. Apparently she likes defense. I don't know. <laughs> Only for me, apparently. Yubel is pretty terrible. I mean, I know I said you can use every character, but like, there's varying degrees of babying, especially on normal. Like, you can pretty much use any character on normal, but yeah. Sirius is good, but unfortunately not as good as FE3. Caster is eh. Warren's better, probably. I wonder what order they're doing in this in. I think they're doing it in joint time now. Sita is okay, she fucking has a lot of speed though, jeez. The Hatchet! Burst is really good. <laughs> Julian's pal, huh? Ricard is the worst thief. Basically, if you don't have Julian, just... You have to use him, basically. Well, you don't have to, but you know. Frey is a pretty good cavalier, but there's too many fucking cavaliers in this game. Norn is... Eh, she's a pretty good archer, actually. I mean, I used her last time, but she was pretty good. She was pretty good, yeah. Santo is a bad Myrmidon. Uh, Wendell is fucking immense, but unfortunately as a unit, he's not as great as he used to be. Elrine's gonna be next? No, it's Caesar, okay. Oh, yeah, yeah, I got Wendell before that. Caesar, Caesar's okay, but he just didn't end up being very good for me. I think it was just luck, honestly. Rat's also pretty okay, but, you know. Unfortunately, he's got so much competition in his areas, it's just, eh. Navar is pretty much your best Myrmidon if you were training him. Well, Maris is pretty good, actually. Fina is excellent, very good dancer, and very good utility unit. Kane's actually not that bad, but once again, another Cavalier. Like, come on. Bantu is really bad. You can use him, he can chip damage, but he's bad. Roger is... Eh, Roger's okay. I would prefer using Doga, but Roger's not too bad. He's actually got more defense than Doga, I think. I keep calling him Doga. <laughs> Perfect shot my ass. George is a mediocre fucking sniper. At least he comes with the Parthia, but that's it. Minerva is pretty good pre promote actually. You need to bring her to the final chapter. She does okay, so yeah, she's not that bad. Etzel, I don't know. Etzel is okay from the healing point of view, but I don't think he's very good. To, like he doesn't have that much magic. Merrick, yeah, uh, Merrick's pretty good. Merrick's pretty damn good, and he gets Excalibur, so that's nice. Yeah, I'm not actually looking at the endings here. <laughs> Maybe I'll look at them later. Elreen is um, he's an okay guy, but he's probably not as good as um, Merrick, unfortunately. Fucking dice! Outrageous. 
Dice is probably your worst fighter, honestly. Maybe better than Cord, I don't know. Maris is actually pretty good. She started a weapon shot instead of fucking gambling at all like fucking Viking dude over here. Horus is eh, I don't like him. Sorry, Horus. He's probably not that bad a unit. Jake is eh. His growths are good, but as a unit he's eh. He's gotta do a lot of catching up. He isn't that bad. X Seawalker. <laughs> yeah. Darius is okay. He's a pretty good pre promote, actually, for being a berserker. And the only berserker. Uh, yeah, Robert is pretty bad. <laughs> pretty bad horseman, unfortunately. Belf! Belf's pretty good. Pretty good cavalier. Once again, it is pretty late, though. And the same with this guy, Leiden. He's he's the same as Belf, basically. He's pretty good as well. But rumors are rumors. Beck is a pretty bad horseman. Maybe even more, probably even more so than Robert. Von Vooman, it even puts it up there. I can't even talk like that in the thing. Athena's well, comes too late, unfortunately, but she's okay. I used her last time. Zane, I never really have the slots to use them, but uh, he would end up being pretty good because he can basically clone your best unit, so yeah. Tiki, she's okay, but I would rather just uh, wait till the end and then use Nagi. You could use Tiki, but yeah. Est is uh, pretty bad, in my opinion. But, you know. Spitting image, huh? Uh, Dolph is a very... Eh, armor knight. A uh, general, when he joins, actually. Abel is, once again, a pre-promote that's not very good. Unfortunately. And yes, he goes after Est. Dead ringer. McKellen is a pretty, pretty bad uh, general as well. Like Dolph. They're pretty much the same, except McKellen has good uh, good growths, but bad pace, worse, even worse than Dolph's bases. Astrum is uh, an okay hero, actually. He's not that bad. Katarina is eh. You can use her. I used her last time, I believe. So, she's not that bad. I mean, she's okay, but eh. Thomas is chip damage. <laughs> Thomas is literally just chip damage. Quiet Bow, yeah, because he has no fucking lines. Shima is amazing. <laughs> I don't care what anyone says. Shima's okay in terms of thing, but I my bias gets in the way, but you know. Samson's actually not that bad a hero. Plus he's an axe hero, and you gotta love those. Frost. Frost is a heal bot that just gives you a free physic staff. I don't really see a use for him. Roche is when we get to the bad pre promotes. Wolfguard, unfortunately. President of Hardin's funeral, huh? Violent, once again. Basically, these four are pretty bad. Uh, I thought I said that he would become a diplomat, but apparently not. Apparently, that was just a rough translation. Yeah, Wolf Guard. Edgar. Now I want to see what Wolf says, because apparently it was like implied suicide uh, from the rough translations. As if searching for death. Yeah. Well, it kind of says it, but I don't know. His anchor. Wow. Media is. Eh. Paladin. Probably better than the Wolf Guard, but still not very good. Jeez, we're getting through these. Emir is an okay. Warrior, actually. <laughs> He's better than most of the way pre promotes. He's still not very good, but you know. And Michaelis is very. pretty good, actually. Apart from his terrible, terrible luck. Fucking conquering continents. What are you on about? Nagi is pretty good. <laughs> pretty good for the latter part of the game, so yeah. No records. And once again, they're going to go for Lena and etc. But 
I have nothing really to say about them, but apart from the fact that uh, they're in the final chapter, woo. And their stats really don't matter. They killed one Wyvern. That was it. That was their job for the four of them. Life giver. She married soon after. I wonder who she married. Yes, it's Merrick. And look at those fucking amount of battles. Yeah, my unit. Broken as she. Yeah. <laughs> I believe Marth is at the end then. Yep, there we go. Marth. Marth's a pretty good um, fifth king, really. <laughs> United Kingdom of Arcania. Yeah, um, Marth's a very good uh, main character. I've got no qualms with him. I, I, it's not like Roy or Leaf here. And at the very end, we get a nice Finn. And a little, little score there in the background. Now, is this a reset my game deal or will it eventually move on? Let's try pressing start here. There we go. I Yeah, I forgot we got ranks here. Speed is B, apparently. Did you enjoy playing to the end? Yes, I did. Alright. Well, guys, uh, there's not really much else to do apart from the three DLC maps and the four BS chapters, which I'm going to hate doing because they're fucking hard. To be fair, the uh, third uh, DLC map is also very annoying. I don't think the other two are too bad. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed Fire Emblem 12, and that was the main story. So I'll see you guys next time.